Greetings and welcome to Rudy Eats. Ru Rudy Eat. Anyways, welcome. And uh, today, for your perusal, we have Jones Soda Blood Orange. And it says, Terror of Blood Orange. I don't know. That doesn't really seem to make any sense to me. But it is what it is. Uh, another. A Halloween offering from the fine folks at Jones Soda. You can always count on them to have a uh, a fun selection of uh, seasonal offering. This is coming in at 100 calories, which seems like quite a lot for this little shooter here. Um, Maybe that's why they're so small, because they're loaded with sugar and you shouldn't be drinking 12 fluid ounces of this. But uh, that is a lovely Halloween orange. When I think of Halloween, this is the orange that I think of, and uh, it's beautiful. Which is interesting, because blood orange is, uh, is reddish, but this is orangish, so... I'm kind of split between the beautiful Halloweeny orange and the fact that they go with the blood orange for the blood tie-in, but it's not red. They had a red licorice, so they couldn't do two reds. I, I don't know. I'm torn. I don't know how I feel about that, but um, I have a little OCD, so that's something that I'll just have to uh, agonize over in my sleep. That's pretty good. Uh, first impression is it tastes of uh, sun-kissed orange soda, but as you uh, as it lingers on the palate, there is a a citrusy. Uh, I hesitate to say bitterness to it, but uh, that's kind of what it reminds me of. Followed by a sort of like an orange zest finish. This is like a, a, a grown-up orange soda, uh, in my opinion. It's not just one note. There's uh, several elements that are blended nicely. And uh, it still has a good orange soda base to it. Something uh, it's easy drinking but uh, wakes your palate up a little bit. And orange soda is the official party drink. Um, just so you know, it, a party is not a party until there's some form of orange soda served. At least that's what I was told. Thank you, and uh, next time I will have something else in a glass.